So here we are at Cisco Live. This is being held in Melbourne. Do a little walk around the area that has a lot of different uh, booths for different vendors. Uh, so you've got all your big vendors here. Obviously Cisco is running the event. We've got the largest vendor, uh, the largest um, booths here, which you can sort of see here behind me. We've got a lot of different technologies showcasing all the latest gear. So if you do work in IT, this is a great place for you to come. So Cisco is run uh, in various cities across the world. Uh, it does change from city to city. This particular one is in uh, Melbourne, Australia. And um, you know, given that it's Cisco that's running it, most of the products will be Cisco oriented. But there is a lot of other vendors out here as well. So really, if you are in um, a level of, let's say a level two, level three technical position uh, within a business, say systems engineer, systems admin, even desktop support, this is a great place for you to come on down and actually get to understand the sort of technologies that are available for you. Uh, you can speak to all a number of different vendors, speak to a lot of technicians, speak to a lot of experts around different offerings that are available, uh, not just in the Cisco realm. Uh, the conference is also um, aimed at uh, people who make, I guess, more sales, corporate, uh, management type of position, so they do have management sessions uh, where you can come and listen to a lot of, uh, I guess, your CISOs, your CIOs, CTOs uh, of various IT businesses, giving you their insight, giving you their understanding on what is happening in the IT space. Um, if you work in security, Cisco Live is an amazing place if you are in the security, uh, security realm. Cyber security is something that is so big uh, now more than ever. So you can definitely come down, speak to the powers that be, people around here, to get up to speed with what's happening on security. So really, it's aimed at anybody in IT, uh, generally in the infrastructure space, um, and has you know have have any any decision making powers around purchasing procurement of infrastructure type of technologies, securing networks, um, monitoring, storage, networking, and a whole range more. You can just come here, you can do a whole bunch of workshops. Play with all the latest tech. Number of seminars that you can just come and just have a listen to. Things on DevOps, your Meraki's. Here we've got one of the other seminars right here. You can come in, you can book yourself a computer, just have a sit down, and you can play around some of the later gear. See all the Mac set up there, which is quite cool. You've got the Innovation Theatre down behind me. Come in and actually listen to a uh, seminar. Let's go see what's going on. Uh, this is the student summit, which started at uh, started in the morning, and it looks like they're talking about some academy alumni things. You can see it's a full house at the moment in here. And this is all covered as part of your standard pass at Cisco Live. So here's an area around the cyber security hub. You see we've got a little area for virtual reality your headsets you can actually go and play with the headset itself also a daily security insights live with a lot of uh, different security experts I'll come here sit down and this is actually streamed out online and throughout the conference 
uh, so you can gauge what's going on from a security standpoint. Got a big wall here showing us what is going on in Cisco Stealth Watch threat wall. You sort of see based on different sorts of alarms. This will use things like umbrella and other Cisco technology to let you know what is going on in your network. Um, you know, different ICMP. Uh, tracking pings up and down, UDP received up and down. It's actually it's going to be tracking uh, suspicious activity on your network. Nice thing we've got ourselves a cybersecurity operations center, it's actually a SOC. It'll be very similar to what you'd find in a lot of security operations areas where you've got a team of security engineers sitting in front of a whole bunch of screens uh, either looking after security in one business or security over a number of businesses if they're like a managed service security operations area uh, they're gonna be checking tickets you know reviewing multiple different security uh, platforms uh, so you can see that they're running Cisco umbrella that are in the back have other threat, threat response technologies by Cisco and really gives you a good health overview of multiple networks here we got ourselves a threat hunting game. You can come here, sit with other fellow techs on a computer, and you can come in and essentially try to hack your way in to a particular system. You can see some scores there, for people who have previously attempted the game. A good overview, Cisco Live, Melbourne, and you just go through a number of things. You'll read some lines of code, you'll check some you know, security, well, it seems to be security threats, malware, those sort of things, and try to get your way in. And as you can see, there's nice prizes at the end of it. So let's do a little walk around. Got the main Optus stand. What do they give you here? Webcam cover. Oh, fancy. IBM. got Commvault, which is obviously your backup solution, one of the leaders in terms of backups. Google Cloud. We've got Veeam, not too far away from our Commvault stand, direct competitor in terms of your backup space. So here is the main Cisco area, so the largest area here at the uh, event itself so you can come and see a lot of their equipment uh, you can walk around you can see things around their cyber security range you can see things around email security uh, they've got sections on uh, their Webex and their Cisco Spark uh, teleconfering, uh, teleconferencing technologies uh, so this is all the Webex stuff here and the great thing is you've actually got Cisco experts you can see the guys there in white here's some more of them um, essentially they're Cisco employees uh, and each booth has a couple or one or two uh, Cisco employees we can actually come have a chat to and they are the experts in that particular technology so you can really get up to speed with what that technology is so it's really the, the best place to get all of your um, a nice big logo get all of your Cisco questions answered all in the one spot uh, so a lot of the time you know you'll get particular Cisco people coming into an office if you're trying to trial a new product you know, a new firewall a new switch a new wireless access point well here you can come out and they've got all the equipment as you can see right here demo you can ask the questions and they will tell you exactly what's going on they've got all computers all set up where you can go and play with all of the infrastructure itself we've got a DNA center you can see how the health of certain environments are Got whiteboards, which is great. These are a very good example of your, you know, your Catalyst 9000 series. And they've got all the products here. And then I can talk to one of these friendly Cisco employees to give me a bit more of an overview of the Cisco product. NetApp, storage provider, the storage provider of NAS and SAN solutions. You 
considering the size of VMware, they haven't really set up a huge stall this year. Pure storage, storage provider, enterprise. So they've currently got a uh, session going. Let's have a look. We've got these partner think tanks as well. Come on down. I sit down and sort of understand what they do. So these are sort of scattered on the ends of the venue. This one's been held, there you go, La Trobe University. Cuts and styles. You wanna come get a free haircut while you're at Cisco Live. That is quite cool. So there you have it, that is my walkthrough at uh, Cisco Live. As you can see, there's a lot of different uh, things that you can do while you are out here. We've obviously spent a lot of the time looking at the innovation area where you can see all of the different vendors and the different providers and play with all the latest tech. Um, but you can come and check out a lot of different seminars. You can understand a lot of the products from Cisco experts. You can go on keynotes, you've got huge events. You can come and play with the labs. You can play with the latest um, you know, dev environments, uh, the whole lot. So there's definitely a lot of cool stuff that you can do while you're here at Cisco Live. Um, an event for every every single IT professional to at least come at least once in their IT career, if not multiple times. So I'd love it if you commented below, let me know your thoughts about this, and uh, subscribe to my channel, Digital by Computing, and like this video as well, I'd really appreciate it, and we will see you next time.